Hey, this is just a quick update with my Welsh pool wild garlic. Have a look. Coming through. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, which you can see coming up so far. That's my Welsh pool wild garlic. What I got from Welsh pool last year, planted it in there. I actually thought it died and it's just come back. I want to show you something over here. Um, I actually didn't mean to grow this avocado um, plant here. Well, I did, but I didn't think anything of it. I just totally forgot about it. Put the seed in the plant pot. The plant pot got overtaken with loads of weeds. I couldn't see it, it was buried. Um, last year I went to clear out all the plant pot and I seen this nice, exotic looking plant. I was thinking, what is that? And then when I looked down at the base, it was the avocado, the seed. So I've put it in here, all of it. But I was given some local Welsh pool wild garlic. And obviously not local to where I live, but local like, not too far anyway, some lady nearby, she, she grows um, wild garlic naturally in her back garden. And I just took the whole thing out of the plant pot, planted it here, and look, the wild garlic is coming up. There's wild garlic, more there, more there. It's wild garlic. As you can see here, all of this was filled with wood chips last year. The majority of it's breaking down. And all I'm doing, I'm just digging it up, using it as fresh and fertile compost. And I'm just filling up this bed with it here. So all of this, as you could see in the last video, with the quick update, was filled with all this dry straw. Well, all these dried weeds. And now I'm just covering it with some nice, um, compost the wood chip got brought down from last year and i'm just going to do that process every single year i put fresh new compost sorry uh, fresh new wood chip just like this in here let it break down naturally one year later i'll just use that as my compost and that's all i'm going to do so i'll probably do this every february to march something like that probably do it every february just before spring, dig it up, spread it throughout the um, bed. I've got nice, fertile, fresh um, compost. Obviously, you can see it's not quite broken down, but the majority of it's broken down. But I'm not really bothered. It's pretty good anyway. Nice and dark and rich. So yeah, I'll do another update very soon. See you later.